On this question, we want to solve the exponential equation using the method of relating the bases by first rewriting the equation in the form b to the u equals b to the v. The equation that we'd like to solve is 3 to the x minus 6 equals 1 over 27. So before we start solving this equation, let's discuss this method of relating the bases. So the method of relating the bases starts off with you writing your equation in this form, b to the u equals b to the v. This is very important for the method because the method requires that we have the base on each side of the equation being the same. And when the base on each side is the same, we can use a property of exponential functions, the one-to-one -one property. Um, this is a property that we discussed in previous chapters. The one-to-one -one property, um, it doesn't just apply to exponential functions, it applies to many types of functions. Um, but what it tells us is that if the y's are equal to each other, if we have two y values that are equal to each other, then those x values must be equal to each other. And that's what we're going to use once we've written the expression in this form, or the equation in this form. Um, we consider this left-hand side to be a y value and the right-hand side to be a y value. And we've got the equal sign stating that they're equal to each other. And the exponents, these are the x values. And because we have an exponential expression on each side, we can say that these exponents are equal to each other. Um, this works because exponential functions have this one-to-one -one property. And you can say that when the y values are equal, the x values must be equal. So that's what we're going to use in this um, equation. So what's nice is that you start off with an equation that's an exponential equation. And once you apply the property, you've simplified it to another type of equation. Usually it's going to be a linear or quadratic equation from this point here on. So our equation is 3 to the x minus 6 equals 1 over 27. So our first challenge is writing the equation in this format. We want to have the bases match each other. I have a base on the left of 3. And I'm going to try to write the right-hand side with a base of 3. 27 is the same thing as 3 cubed. So I can write this as 1 over 3 cubed. Now I don't want that in the denominator, so I'm going to move that factor to the numerator. And we can put a negative on the exponent. using our exponent properties in order to move that factor to the numerator. So now we've written it so that we have the same base on both sides. And we can use this method of relating the bases, this one-to-one -one property, and say that these exponents have to be equal to each other. So we have the equation x minus 6 equals negative 3 x minus 6 equals negative 3 is a linear equation. I'll add 6 to both sides and get x equals 3. So we have the solution to our equation being 3. Thank you for checking out my videos. Have a great day.